Creative friends, today we will look at some old software that used to be very popular and I will show you the new programs that have replaced them, giving you a much better experience today. We will talk about antivirus programs, screen recording tools, video chat apps, system cleaners and file compressors. So with that being said, let's dive in. In the past, having third-party antivirus software like MCAFI or Norton was essential for protecting your computer from viruses and malware. Programs like Avira, Avast or AVG were also commonly used. Today, if you stick to safe websites and avoid downloading suspicious files, Microsoft Defender built into Windows can provide adequate protection. It's as effective as a third-party antivirus program and it doesn't slow down your PC. While Microsoft Defender is reliable, malware by itself as a great backup tool to catch traits that Defender might miss. If you were a gamer in the late 90s or early 2000s, you probably used Fraps to record your gameplay. It was the go-to software for recording and sharing your game footage. But here is the thing, Fraps hasn't been updated since 2013 and it's pretty outdated now. Nowadays, when it comes to capturing your screen or broadcasting live on platforms like YouTube or Twitch, OBS Studio is the go-to choice. With OBS Studio, you can effortlessly create and switch between multiple scenes, adjust audio levels with the built-in mixer, and fine-tune various settings to achieve the perfect setup for your recording or live streams. Moreover, it's compatible with Windows, Mac, and Linux operating system, and it receives frequent updates to ensure it stays current and reliable. Back in the days, Skype was the king of video calls. It was launched in 2003 and as of then, it was the go-to app for catching up with friends and family or holding business meetings. But as time passed, it started to feel outdated compared to newer apps. For those who likes to stick with the Microsoft ecosystem, Microsoft Teams is the perfect upgrade. It was released in 2017 and it has all the features Skype offered and more. It's great for work, school or just chatting with friends. Microsoft Teams free plan lets you have group calls up to 60 minutes long with up to 100 people plus unlimited chats and 5 gigabytes of cloud storage. If you need more features, their paid plan starts at about $7 a month. CCleaner was previously popular for maintaining computer performance, but Windows 10 and 11 include built-in tools for the same purpose. Today, Microsoft PC Cleaner is preferred over the outdated CCleaner which some tech sites still promote, most likely because they are getting paid to promote it. Microsoft PC Cleaner provides effective system cleaning and management features in a safe and reliable package. WinZip has been around since the early 90s, helping people compress and unzip files. But if you are using Windows now, you don't really need it. Windows has built-in zip functions that handles most of what WinZip does. For those who need more features, 7-Zip is a fantastic option. It's free, open source, and works on Windows 11 and older versions. It handles a wide range of file formats and offers powerful compression options. If you like to know software you should never install on your PC, click on this video and keep watching. Was this video helpful? Leave a like and share it with a friend. And let me know in the comments, what old program do you think should be replaced and what will you replace them with? I will see you in the next one.